Hello there! Today we will learn how to make masking in Photoshop even faster by using shortcuts. You might think, why should I make shortcuts for something that I can already do in a few seconds? Well, if you work on complex composites with a lot of layers and advanced masking, there is actually quite some time to spare. But without further ado, let's get started. I always wondered why there was no built-in shortcuts for making a mask in Photoshop. You have to use your mouse, pen or trackpad to find this little icon in the layer panel. If you want to work really fast in Photoshop, using shortcuts is the way to go. In the layer mask menu, we actually have menu options for masking and today we will look into these options. They work a little different than the icon options. The first one, reveal all. Simply add a white mask, just as when pressing the little icon we know so well. Let's undo the mask and make a selection of the rows. Again we add a mask using the menu Reveal All. Still a white mask, but unfortunately not based on our selection. We undo one more time. And the next option, Hide All, is adding a black mask. Very useful in many situations and the same as if you had pressed ALT or OPTION while pressing the mask icon. Let's go back, select the rows, hide all. This option is not working with selections either. So let's hope our third option, reveal selection, is a better choice. We make a selection of the red rows one more time and click reveal selection. Finally we get a mask based on our selection, but does this option work when we have no selection? Unfortunately not. That means we have to use all three options if we want the same freedom as when using the icon. Time to assign some shortcuts. We navigate to edit keyboard shortcuts or we could use the shortcut for shortcuts. That's option shift command K. On a PC you have to press ALT SHIFT CONTROL K. Basically the main differences between Mac and PC when it comes to working inside Photoshop is CONTROL on a PC is COMMAND on a Mac and the CONTROL on a Mac is right clicking because the Mac mouse don't have two buttons. And then there is ALT key it's called OPTION on a Mac well on some Mac keyboards it's called ALT. Back to assigning shortcuts. We find the layer section and unfold the tab and scroll further down to layer mask and here is the three options we want to activate. Now we just need to find the right shortcuts for these three options. If I just press for instance the plus key I get an error message. We need to include a function key and or the command key besides a letter. And we have to find combination that's not already in use. For me, living in a Scandinavian country, it's pretty easy because we have the letters A, Ø and O. I use the combination Command plus A for Reveal All, Command Ø for Hide All and Command O for Reveal Selection. And now we have a super fast shortcut for masking. Let's make a selection. Try our new shortcut, voila, we have a mask. I hope this little tutorial will make it work even faster in Photoshop. If you will support my channel, please like, subscribe, add a comment or ring that bell for future notifications. Well, you could continue, of course, with one of my other tutorials.